and welcome to Mission Vista High School's newscast. I'm Case. I'm Keenan. And I'm Griffin. This past semester has been completely packed with a whole lot of cool school events. As you know, our campus has a lot of really cool opportunities. Students have done this by joining many different clubs and teams, including our rugby team. Here at Mission Vista, we have an assortment of sports and club activities. One that has recently come to Mission Vista is rugby. So rugby was good last year. Uh, we had a lot of people come out. Even though it was our first year, we uh, came out on top, winning our uh, division league championship, which is really cool for a first year team especially with our league. Um, we're told that we're gonna go up into a bigger league this year. I think that's really cool because I think we're gonna grow even more together. And I think that's gonna be really awesome. So uh, this upcoming year is gonna be really cool because I wanna see a lot of the new people that come in and see their talents. And then a lot of our returning uh, brothers and stuff, like we're just a huge family. And no matter if you're new, if you're old, yeah, you're part of our family, and that's just how the rugby culture is. No matter what, uh, you're part of a you're part of the culture as long as you play. Okay, so I've played sports before, but I think rugby rugby is different, at least for me. You know, it brought out a lot of confidence in me that I can apply to all aspects of my life. And um, not only was it a team, it was a family, and I made great friendships that way. And Rugby was just an overall great experience. It changed a lot of things about me and about my life. I think having rugby was really good. Because we don't offer football, rugby was a great alternative to that. And I know we have a lot of students who would like to have football, but rugby is um, a really good option. Um, we obviously had a ton of success. I know people were really interested in it. And um, what I liked the most is we had a lot of students who wanted to come out. So it was really well supported by the student body. Culturally, it's, a, it's, a, it's different than American sports in that you'll go out and you'll butt heads and you'll fight and you'll play tough rugby games, but afterwards you guys hang. Alright guys, come out, come play some rugby, have some fun, come join the team, and we'll see you out there. <laughs> I got it, I got it! I got it! I got it! Ah! <laughs> oh. <laughs> that actually looks like a really fun sport. What else do we have to add? Well, here at Mission Vista, we have many after school events like cross country and field hockey. But today we're looking at the dance aspect of it. <laughs> Mission Vista High School is a school of technology and performing arts. One of the performing arts here is dance. The MVHS dance team is brand new to this school and currently has 13 members. The dance team was started uh, by me. I was kind of the one that wanted to um, instill it into Mission Vista. There are other high schools in the area that have dance teams and I felt like to really represent dance at Mission Vista, it would be great to have a team. So pushed for it and finally got it this year. The UN dance team has made me be able to work well with others and has pushed me to become a better dancer. We do a lot of different genres in dance team like jazz and hip hop and lyrical and then we're also adding palm which is kind of like cheerleading but more dance into it to make it really awesome. Competitions this year we're going to be traveling to Anaheim and Escondido, California and we're gonna be uh, attending the UDA and USA dance competitions. Basically, there's gonna be a panel of judges that sit there and judge us on our dancing. We're a team, so we're really, um, really close to each other. Everyone gets along, there's no fighting or anything. We're really close. Normal, uh, normal practice, what we do is we'll warm up and um, condition a little bit, so sit-ups, push-ups, all that jazz, and then uh, we'll do some across the floors, so just uh, turns, jumps, leaps, that kind of stuff, 
and then we'll actually, um, for the rest of the class, we'll just work on our uh, routine, the one that we're going to be performing next. To be chosen to be on the dance team, we actually have auditions. Um, this next season, we'll be auditioning in May, which is early, but we work all throughout summer on our technique, um, getting ourselves ready for the next season. So um, you have to come and audition, and it's a three-day audition process. Dance team's awesome. You know, you, it, it's almost like we're a family. So we're doing hard stuff, but we're doing what we love, and we get through it together. Reporting from MVHS TV, I'm Serena Cuomo. And I'm Isabella Alvarez de la Compa. Back, Back to you. Dancing. If only I could. True. Students can also show off their talents at Mission Visit High School. We have many classes and clubs that involve the more artistic side of students' personalities. Music is probably the most popular one here. We have a great course here with Steel Drum, taught by Miss Fennell. Here at Mission Vista High School, we have many fun and engaging electives, one of them being Miss Fennell's Steel Drum class. Mission Vista has had steel drum elective for four years. The first year we were at Washington Middle School and we barely fit in any classroom. And the steel drums are huge, so we ended up not starting the class until the second year itself. The great thing about this class is that you can take it over and over again. It's not like you haven't passed it. Everyone does well on the class, but you always want to take it again because then the same players stay around and the ensembles get stronger and stronger and stronger. is um, to learn like some of us don't know how to read music so most of us are learning how and we're learning more about music and more about the instruments we're playing and to um, play music all together as an ensemble. On a typical class day, students start with reviewing the music they're learning and then they move to the music room. Not only do they learn how to play steel drum, they also play other instruments. We play um, tenors, double tenors, triples, and um, we, we play the steel drum and the xylophone. <laughs> this is my 26th year teaching music. My first job was a high school job, and then I went back and did graduate work in a special methodology in elemental music, and I taught kindergarten through eighth grade for about 20 years, and now I've been at Mission Vista High School for the past five years. I like this class because I get to hang out with some of my friends and Miss Fennell and play wonderful music, beautiful music. I decided to take this class because I took band last year and it was kind of boring. So I wanted to try something different because I've never played steel drum before. CEG. They also perform at school and local events. So on Thursday, October 10th, it will be our first concert of the year. Steel Drum One will be sharing the concert with the choral program. 7 o'clock p.m. in the theater, and I believe it will be $6 at the door. Come and be entertained because the Steel Drum Group not only plays well, but they dance really well too. If you're interested in this course, report to room 103 and talk to Ms. Vanell. Reporting from Mission Vista High School, I'm Dania Zanade. Looks like a really fun music class. You can even perform up here. Too bad I can't. My guitar broke. Don't fret about it. <laughs> anyway, that's all we have for today. Thanks for joining us in Mission Vista, Vista High, High School, School News. Mission Vista High School News. What a name.